the Chipco 2000 Guineas, three-year-old, one mile up the top, Allegro for hands. We've got Anching Acidus and Anching Admiratio, then Big Tom Brady, Hot Pursuit, Ingenious, Django's Jewel, Molly at Steps, Naming Rights, Race from the Storm, Red Danehill, Robber's Lance, Rocket Man, Roots Hall, Scottish Distillery, uh, the Coast d'Azur and Vince Lombardi for Paul Rhodes, number 17. So a fair size field. Crackerjack field, really, the, the trainers involved. Open race. Racing. Oh, great line. Jumping quickly was Race from the Storm. And out wider now, they're pushing forward. We've got Roots Hall, Rocket Man, down towards the fence. Race from the Storm, so stable mates are one, two. Also pushing through there is Vince Lombardi. And that's a six furlong, it's Race from the Storm from Vince Lombardi, ingenious Anching Admiratio. Django's Jewel is up there with Red Dane Hill, Hopper Shoot, Anching Acidus. Then uh, Allegro, Coach D'Azur is wide with Roots Hall. Then we've got Big Tom Brady, Naming Ripes, Molly at Steps and Scottish Distil Distillery. Four furlongs left to go and Race from the Storm is doing it easy up front. No, no pressure on at all. Anching Admiratio is second and a stable mate. Anching Acetus is there as well. Pushing through now, Roots Hall, Rocket Man, Red Dane Hill. Coming into the race, uh, it is Rocket Man making a forward move. So too out wider is Coach, the Coach d'Azur. But it's still uh, Josh's horse race from the storm inside the one and a half. It's holding him for now from Vince Lombardi, Red Dane Hill, Rocket Man. It's still race from the storm though at the half. Now they've caught it. And Vince Lombardi takes the lead by a long neck to Rocket Man. And Vince Lombardi wins from Rocket Man. I reckon the Coach Dizur flew for third. Across the track. This looked like a good field on paper. And it ended up being that way. And Vince Lombardi, congratulations. Paul Rhodes, 100 to 1. Don't see that too often. Second, Rocket Man, Joshua Sutherland. Third, Red Dane Hill for David Robinson. Uh, fourth was the Coach d'Azur, uh, Darren Thompson, and his horse, Roots Hall, finished fifth as well. So that was a good race. There wasn't too much between the majority of the field at the end.